Welcome back everyone to another episode of your Daily Dose. Today, I figured it's been a while since I've done a power-up video and Yawning Way is starting to lag. <laughs> it's starting to lag a little bit behind in the power department. So I figured, why not uh, do a little bit of an upgrade, take advantage, of course, of the Halloween event. Um, unfortunately, it looks like I won't be able to maximize any of my beasts, which is a little bit sad. I was hoping to get Karkadon to 7 star, but that's not going to happen for quite some time. But we will probably be able to grab some other things. So I reckon we'll grab these ones out. Uh, because why not? We should just probably try and grab as many of these ones out as well. Oh, actually, I probably should have got you first. Hmm... You know what? That is, that's fine. <laughs> that's fine. We can always grab you for gold if we do need to get you a little bit later on. But what I was thinking, what I was thinking, because arms race is upon us. So for those that are going to spend a little bit and get on the leaderboards, I feel like it's going to be a good opportunity to spend uh, if you aren't saving up. For those that are curious, I, I'm considering potentially spending a little bit of the gold merits. I do have some selection chests, which I will probably just keep chilling in the bag. Uh, gold wise, there's not too much that I need to buy at the moment, which is good. And of course, we can always grab some of these if we need to. Probably gonna start to need more of these mythic charm chests, even though we do have close to 100. Um, but I won't spend any just yet, just in case we need some more of these epic uh, books, which are kind of painful. <laughs> It's kind of painful, right? Because you realize you just need so many of them to upgrade everything to legendary and, of course, mythic. But we will grab the accessory stones. In terms of the event itself, nothing has been added to the shop. So if you are thinking about spending, probably just grab what you can in terms of wings or, of course, some Generation 3 heroes. I feel like that's what most players will be investing in. If you are going to be patient, though, just remember... That in the next couple of events, there is going to be a high probability that the mythic tactics will become available to buy for gold merit. At least that's what we're speculating in the community. Hopefully, um, that does actually eventuate. But, you know, worst case scenario, you can just keep saving gold merits up anyway, because there's really not too much to spend on if you've been around for a little while playing this game. Uh, but in terms of that, I feel like this is going to be the next Annihilation event update. I feel like we're going to be able to probably max out this Divine Weapon in the next couple of uh, weeks, which will be fantastic. Obviously, we are waiting for the Generation Force to appear. Uh, but while we do wait, I should probably do some smart upgrading. <laughs> do it smart. Do it smart, PB. Don't waste anything this time around. So we're going to go into the Glory Hall, and I think I unlocked this pretty recently. So we're going to grab some Imperishable gear sets. For those that don't know, you can, of course, grab Imperishable gear set and some Beast gear if you do push Glory Hall. So it is kind of recommended to do so. So we are going to be able to get at least a helmet. I want to say at least a helmet. Um, and of course, we do have another one chilling in the bag, a full piece of gear. So we'll need to see what else we need. So let's grab the helmet out. Let's go ahead and synthesize that. Hmm. What do we need? Uh, beast hunt. Well, it'd be rude not to have a look, right? It'd be rude not to have a look. We did manage to get a full piece of mythic gear uh, recently. Oh no, I think I killed Larry, one of our wolves. Oh, damn it, Larry. I'm sorry, man. <laughs> I'm sorry. Uh, I hope it was one of our wolves. It could have been the other clan that's called wolves. There's two clans apparently in our server bracket, which confuses the heck out of me, but hopefully that wasn't it. Hmm. All right, so while we're doing this, I'm thinking to myself, I have a Moonlight Charm that I would like to start incorporating to PvP because silence is still pretty lethal in this day and age. So I want to maybe try to get the synergies for that, which means I might have to spend some wishing coins and maybe some gold. But we do have enough to get at least a Dao chant. Oh, okay, so there we go. <laughs> Karma came back and killed us really, really quick. But what I was thinking is, we kind of want to awaken this charm because we did get it to one star, right? 
Yeah, I feel like we got this to one star. And it's not that bad, right? We should probably, like, try to max enhance that as well. But I haven't awakened it yet. And I can't... Ooh, we actually have it two star, which isn't too bad for the silence chance. But I do... I do feel like this wouldn't be a bad idea to use. Um, what are combos am I currently using? Well, I'm doing this for the DPS, but in PV... P, I do think like, yeah, we kind of need to upgrade. We need to get that silence out there because it is very frustrating to fight against. So that will be our first goal on the list. Uh, we will pull out some of these ones. We'll grab some of the gold and the VIP packets. We can open some of these ones up as well. I uh, Oh, we got vision. Very cool. 2% accuracy. Nice. Very nice. Very nice. Of course, we got the crappy iron wall. Transformation boxes, we'll grab that. Weapon selection boxes. It's just weird how the game randomly gives us so much stuff that you'll never ever use. <laughs> right? All right, let's see. Is there anything that I can upgrade here? 180, 240, 100. Probably not because we only got 47 and 64. Um, I really am just focusing on ranking up. Oh, actually, you know what? We might be close enough to get you up one level. That's good. I am working on the seven star sword for our main DPS, which is of course War God Liao Zhang, because the seven star sword is probably one of the best weapons for him. If you don't know, Blue Blade Sword is phenomenal on Zhang Fei and of course Guan Yu for the Shu Nation synergy. Um, so we should be close to being able to do that. Now I know I'm bouncing all over the shop. Let me know in the comment section down below, has this event actually worked out to be quite nice for you? Have you been making some gains? Can I actually buy one of these boxes? I can't, I need 10 of these damn things. <sighs> I'm not going to buy the grade 20, uh, just because I already have the last beast unlocked for the G4, so it doesn't really make sense on a game, well, should I say an account like this. Let's grab those, that should be 10, that should be just enough to get us a 7 star sword upgrade. Da, da, da. Am I close? I'm very close. We'll just go all of them in there anyway. Tactics, because it keeps glowing red at me. <laughs> Let's see. Where's my weapon? Divine weapons. No. Oh, no. I did the wrong thing. Now I have to go and bloody discard that thing. Hey, we might get you to four star. Let's go. We get an additional uh, feature when we hit four star. For those that don't know, every time you get up to four and seven star, you do get some cool new abilities. So that's nice. How many of you do I have? I've got three. So we might be able to do some of you a little bit later on as well. But let's focus on getting the... Let's focus on getting some Dao Chan shards. Dao Chan, Dao Chan, Dao Chan. Where are you, Dao Chan? I know where you are. You're a warlord. Let's pull you out. Uh, let's go Dao Chan. 15 there. Do I have any of the Gen 1s? I only have two of you. Ooh, that's going to be tough. Oh, I already got 50 of you. Very nice. All right. Well, at least we have 50 of you, so it's going to be a little bit easier. But we will go to the Wish Shop first. We will grab some of these ones out, which is another 12. So we're going to go and put them into Dao Chan. And... Fingers crossed, fingers crossed. We need 74 bunny girl. So bunny girl, let's go 70. And then I want to say we're going to be a little bit short. <laughs> I might need to spend some gold, but that's okay. Yeah, we're going to be a lot short actually. Oh, Maybe I'll have to be impatient. Should I be patient? Mm. I could spend the gold to do it. Could do it. I could do it. And I mean, index score is index score, right? Or I could just keep waiting and buying them every single day and play it smart. How many shards are we missing? Actually, I don't want to do that just yet. How many shards are we missing? Uh, wrong tab. I always do that. Shards. So Dao Chan's at 89. So we like, I want to say like 30 shards short, 31 shards short. Hmm. I mean, it's doable. 
it's the same price me buying it here or, or me buying it there um so you know i might as well just go ahead and buy uh we're just gonna buy them all <laughs> we're gonna waste our gold although is it really a waste i don't think it i don't think it's a waste we're not gonna say it's a waste we just decided to spend them we'll just grab all 40 out anyway because i'm sure that we will eventually upgrade these guys and maybe start building the other ones so we need 31 i think is it 31 i hope so i hope it's only 31 there we go bingo so that was part of the plan was essentially to unlock the awakening of the combo charm so that we can actually use this so that's going to be pretty cool you don't really get much of a oh can i awaken these ones too i can oh ah, very nice my phone is about to die <laughs> we'll be fine we will be fine. Oh, there we go. We got some bonus uh, awakenings that I wasn't actually expecting. But where is my... Where is it? Where is it? Where is it? Not you. Where's the other one? Okay. So, I say we take you out and I say we put you in there. That makes sense, right? Get the Moonlight Dance in there. That's going to be fantastic. Get some silences out there. Grab the achievements because why not? <sighs> So what else is there to do in terms of upgrading? I did that, which is what I wanted to do. The next thing I kind of wanted to do was to make some imperishable gear sets. So at the moment, I think I'm only rocking it, right? Oh, wow. Doesn't look like I'm actually running my... Oh, I think I upgraded you, that's why. Oh, I went all in on you. <laughs> Not that that's a bad thing. We actually might go a split set with uh, this guy here. I'm going to go a split set with Papa Chu because he's an absolute monster. For those that don't know, he's absolutely phenomenal for his uh, damage. Although, granted, he wasn't great when he first came out because I don't think a lot of people knew how to use him. But now that I know how to use him, he is fantastic with the mythic weapon. He really has a high stun chance and some pretty decent splash damage as well which we'll be doing a couple of live examples of that, hopefully. <laughs> hopefully we'll be doing that sooner than later. So what we need to do is go ahead and recycle. I want to say we have to recycle some of these things, right? We're going to have to reset the equipment, reset, and then reset. It's probably going to take a very long, long time, this video. So if you're not into it, you can always just skip ahead to see the final result. But... For those that are curious, drop your comments in the beginning of the video. How much power do you reckon we'll get? Do you think we'll hit 80 billion? Or do you think we will only get a couple of billion? I don't know. Personally, I'd like to say we can get to 80 billion. But let's be honest, it might not happen. It might not be a thing. Uh, but I am happy that we did manage to grab a couple of pieces of Imperishable Gear Set. So we should be able to finish this guy off. Next Annihilation event, fingers crossed. Worst case scenario, we'll be able to get one more piece for him anyway. Uh, but it is definitely worth running the split set if you are able to get it. I wish there was a quick button, like a, a quick all or a blitz button here, but there's not, which is fine. I'm just going to stop complaining. <laughs> uh, how was your weekend, everybody? Did you get up to anything new, exciting? Uh, have you managed to download the Dynasty Origins Conquest yet? I know that uh, it hasn't quite yet been released for Europe and, of course, America, but it is definitely on the table. It is definitely going to be coming, uh, I want to say, within the next couple of days. The rumor mill said the 12th, so we'll have to wait and see if that's actually going to happen. But worst case scenario, it will be at some point during the month, and it's certainly a game for you to just check out. Don't spend any money on it. Uh, check it out first. See if you like it. Really, if you are going to buy anything, I recommend just getting the Zhao Un package for $1.59 and the base subscription. Uh, it'll get you to VIP 1, and then after that, you really don't have to spend any more money on the game if you don't want to. In fact, this one game that I really don't feel like I need to wail on, which is pretty fantastic. Uh, all things considered, I don't feel like I need to spend a lot of money in order to advance it, which I'm currently enjoying the experience. It's a very new experience for me. <laughs> anyway, let's see if we can get you up to level 100. For those that don't know, these cap out at, I believe, 120. So we won't be able to get there. We're going to be able to get 79. But this one gives attack percentage, so it's definitely worthwhile investing. 
And of course, we need to imbue these guys. Oh my gosh, it's going to take forever. But it's totally worth it. I wonder if anyone is uh, excited about the prospect of the Generation 4 Mythic Heroes. I hope that uh, they live up to their hype, particularly Shao Pi. Um, of course, that demon guard, yeah, Jan Wei? Wei Yan? Oh man, I cannot remember him for the life of me. The demon dude, he seems pretty uh, pretty OP for Shu, so I'm kind of excited to experiment. Uh, whether or not I run him on this account, I'll have to see. I'll probably have to get away. Probably have to get rid of Jiang Wei if that's going to be the case, because you kind of need to have, you kind of need to have Xiao Ji in order to proc Xiao Pi's uh, paralysis, because it works on, as far as I can tell, it works on uh, if the enemy is currently being controlled, which of course is something that Xiao Ji does as an AOE ability as well. Um, so that'll be very interesting to see whether or not we can experiment. Um, Double Shao P could be in the works. It could be a thing. I might get rid of the transformation of Zhang Fei and do a double Shao Fi. <laughs> Shao P. Shao P. My goodness. Can I say it? Can I say it right, chat? Probably not. All right, let's rank these ones up. Let's go. I feel like we should have been able to do much higher than that, but apparently we can't. Imbuing. Uh, we can just stick at that level. We can engrave them, though. Get them up to Tiger. <laughs> It does get a little bit more expensive as you do rank up, unfortunately. So we're going to get these guys to Tiger, though, so that should be okay. Get some Tiger action. And boom. All right, so we did make a little bit of headway in terms of power. I feel like we, we made a, a tiny bit of power, right? <laughs> uh, we can't complain, though. We cannot complain. I should probably, uh, probably should buy some of those stones. Probably should buy some of those accessory stones. We'll have to think about that. But that's what I wanted to do after, of course, getting the synergies. Now, what's next? Is there anything that I can potentially upgrade? I feel like we could probably do some of these tactics. I feel like, can we do the tactics? I got you. Do I have enough of you? Oh, heck yeah, I do. All right. Well, that's... That's okay. That's good. One, two, three. And, oh, we mythicized it. Oh, okay. Let's go. We managed to get you to mythic. <laughs> I was not planning that, but uh, apparently that's just what happened. Did we get the other one to mythic yet? We did. Oh, let's go. You know, it might even be worth me getting seduce on this account. Um, it might be worth me doing that. Interesting. I'll have to think about that though, because it is pretty expensive. It's going to cost us around 300. You're going to have some accuracy because, you know, why not? We can equip resolution to you as well. Um, is there anyone else that wants to get equipped to? Yep. So we can grab that, throw someone you. Anyone else? No. Let's upgrade Iron Wall. Really, it doesn't matter who you upgrade it on. Like, I'm not going to lie to you. It's, it, it doesn't matter that much. Just <laughs> pick one and upgrade it because uh, the tier ups don't give very much power or anything like that. It's just raw statistics for those that are curious. Uh, but you will need a bucket load of grade twos to get to grade threes though. So you can't really slack on that. You do need to upgrade them as you get the copies from, of course, the siege event uh, or conquest, I should say, which is, yeah, it's kind of sucky. Conquest is kind of sucky. I'm not liking it as much as I thought I would, but, um, you know, it is what it is, right? Let's do some of these ones. I think we can do some indexes and then we can probably see if we can uh, maybe do some star karma after that. And then we can do some uh, fights, I think. Do some fights and beast gear. Remind me I need to do beast gear because that's kind of important. I do need to do some beast gear. Um, so we grab that. I think that's good how many of these little things do we have 207 we might be able to get a seven star if we get lucky yes yes we can so we need six and then we need 80 i think right yes <laughs> we're just winging it we're just gonna go with the 80 is there anyone close to another seven star um not quite. So we might go some six stars at 240 so we can get 30 of you out. 
and then we can grab the rest of you as well so three that makes 10 33 and boom and i think we should be okay i think we should be okay in terms of uh just making those indexes pretty sure i have enough of the uh scrolls that you need it's one of those weird things you go in an account after a few months of just hoarding essentially and then you realize you just have so much stuff to do which is fantastic of course because i mean that's the that's the main thing that i like about this game is the opportunity to do some power-ups i wonder if we can actually uh i wonder if we can actually make it warlord we don't have enough are you kidding me really where did i spend them all that's crazy Good thing we have like 12 of these things though. Do we get some out of you? Yeah, we do. Okay. Phew. <laughs> so I don't have to spend gold on that. Here I'm thinking we had an abundance of them, but apparently not. But this should give us just enough. 180. Mm, yep. Beautiful. 9.5%. So we got to 7.5 billion, 75 billion, I should say, not 7.5. Hmm. We need to get quite a lot in order to get ourselves up to, I want to say... 80 billion. I don't know if it's possible. <laughs> I think I was a little bit over ambitious about that one, but it's okay. We have been able to uh, get quite a lot of gear sets, which is fantastic, which I feel like is what the majority of players probably, if they've been paying any sort of attention to the videos in the past, uh, I feel like you probably have already got most of your GeForce sorted. We can probably do these ones as well, but before we do that, I reckon... How many of these stargazers do we have? We have like 400 of you, which is redonkulous. We do need to do you, though. I need to grab these ones and make sure that we can get it finished. Because there's no point hoarding this, because you only can do 50 a day, so it's kind of a waste. A little bit of a waste, which we don't want. We can do... Uh, I feel like we can do like 30 of these. Oh, that was a really good pull. I mean, it would have been perfect if we got a legendary, but that's a lot of that's a lot of red. I see, quite nice. Let's see one more, and we got some epics as well, which is fine. So we got two hundred for the event when that comes out. Uh, for those that keep asking me, do you need to save for rebate? You don't really need to save for rebate, um, but you know it can't hurt you if you do have a couple uh, stashed away for when the cooking festival appears. Did we get you? We got the Thunder Beast to four star, did we? Nice. That's a good. That's a good investment strategy. What I need to do though is probably not, because that's a G four on you, so it doesn't make sense for me to swap the G four out. What I think we should do is we should use this on you, and then we should use this on you. Right. <laughs> we actually lost Bell. Damn, but this one wasn't too bad. We did get mainly defensive statistics, but it is what it is. This one, again, kind of defensive, but hey, look, they gave it to us for free, so I am not complaining. I am not complaining at all. Um, let's see if I can actually throw... Can I throw you in there? I can. Let's go. Oh, uh, what? No, 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 no. We were supposed to add you to that one. <gasps> Game, what did you do? Why would you do that? That doesn't make any sense. And I've got a G4 horn. Okay, I need to unlock you. I need to unlock you. What do, what do I have a G4 horn for? Oh, no, don't tell me I rolled a G4 horn. I already have too many G4 horns. Ah, damn it. Damn it, game. Why did you give me that? All right, anyway, let's go and enhance this. Let's, uh, let's do it the right way this time. <laughs> let's see if we can get you up there. Oof, oof. We almost need a full billion with that single uh, upgrade. Honestly, I don't think we're going to be able to get very far with this one, but that's okay. Hopefully, we'll be able to do a, a successful beast hunt after uh, it resets in a couple of minutes. So while we're waiting for that, we should probably go ahead and pull out our gracious gift for the Halloween event. Let's see if we've got anything we can use. I'm expecting to go up one full bar. I feel like... Even if I have to spend a little bit of gold, I want to be able to get that one full bar. Um, I may even just do another 100 premium pulls. <laughs> Risk it for the biscuit. We'll see. I don't, I don't want to spend 
uh, too many legendaries. I kind of want to, you know what I mean? You, you kind of want to see if you can get the ones that only take one or two. So this one takes two. Interesting. Come on, game. Don't do that to me. That takes two. That takes three. Oh, my gosh. That's two there. We're still missing some. We might not even be able to do it. That's crazy. We might not even be able to do that. We're going to activate that, though, because that's only two. That makes sense. Um, what else is there? That's already activated. So we only need one of you. So we're going to grab you. Let's go ahead and activate that. Shao Shao. Is there anything that I can do? Please, please game. At least don't screw me over with stuff that I already have. That would suck. All right. So we can do two of you. Very nice. <laughs> this game. I can already tell it's going to do it to me, isn't it? It really is. Um, what about you? I guess we could buy. I guess we. I guess we could buy you, right? That would make sense. Let's uh, let's go ahead and do that. Let's grab some gold. Spend some gold there. <sighs> and where were you? Where were you? You were the one down here. So let's go ahead and use you. Oof. Nice. Very, very nice. Um, is there anything that we could potentially get away with? Potentially get away with. Uh, I'll wait for that in a second. One, two, one. Okay. Zhen. So we do need, we're going to need to be able to get you. And of course, can I get Lu Bei from, I cannot, oh, damn it. I thought we might be able to roll for him, but apparently he's not in the star yeah, he's definitely on a star. So that's two more. That's 10k gold. Hmm. 10k gold. That's going to be expensive. I don't think we're going to be able to do that. <laughs> now I'm thinking, did I need to spend all that gold on those uh, Gen freaking 5 legendary shards? Probably not. Um, but I think during the event, we should be able to grab some additional ones, which is fine. Why don't we go ahead and do some minor upgrades that don't require uh, legendaries? That would be good. We do, of course, have quite a lot of... Uh, no, I need to keep Guan Yu. I need to keep... Do I need to keep... How many copies of you do I have? I have four. Okay. As long as you've got four of you, that's fine. It's when you only have one that you kind of go, okay, that might not be good. We'll keep two back just in case. How many of you do I have? I have three. So we can go ahead and do one of you. What about you? I only have one and I've got two gunnings. Nah, too, too risky, too risky. We don't want to go ahead and do that just in case. How many Guan Yu's do I have? I only have one of you. Hmm. Well, I mean, we did get four. We did get four. I'll give you that. It is, it almost, it just doesn't seem any, doesn't make any sense to to gamble because there's no one that I can actually get that I can use, uh, which kind of sucks. Although it's it, it did appear to have Lu Bay up there, which is kind of confusing too. All right, so we did get to seventy seven point four billion. What else can we do to do some upgrades? Hmm. We're kind of in that weird pickle of a place. We might be able to get you to one star. Why not? We'll do that. Uh, and then we can probably start to see if we can upgrade our main DPS. Get you up to one star. I mean, I could go ahead and just one star the other one as well, or three star the Emerald Lyra. Not bad, not bad. Co-op. No, I don't want to enhance you. Hmm. What do I want to do next? I want to get you, definitely I want to get you uh, up to uh, Dragon. So let's go and grab some of you. We do have a whopping amount of these things. Before I do that, I'm just going to grab these. I'm not going to spend any just yet. So we'll get you up to Dragon. Very nice. 23 plus percent attack. Very, very cool. Soul Forge, apparently we can do some Soul Forging, but uh, I don't know what for. I'd have to sit down and think about that. We got you up to dragon for your relics. Do I have anyone that split dragon, dragon? 
dragon, tiger. Yeah, you don't need accuracy. Tiger, tiger. Maybe we can get you up. Let's see if we can uh, get you engraved. Perfect. Get you up to Phoenix. Get some additional accuracy and evasion. Mythicizing you, that does seem pretty legitimate, but I have to wait. I have to uh, focus on mythicizing these ones first, I think. Let's get you up. Oh yeah, I think we're I think we're in the clear. <laughs> we might be able to get one more level. Let's go. All right, and can I get any more though? I feel like it's a yes. I have eighty of those shards. What do you think? I feel like it's a yes. So we're at forty five percent. So if we get like. 10 of those and 20 of the red ones. So we go like this. So we go 20, 20 red. 10 of you. And then 10 of you. And hopefully 10 of you. I say, uh, yeah, I reckon we got enough. I reckon we got enough to do one more level, which is fantastic. Let's go ahead and mythicize you. That's what we like to see, the little red dot, which means we can do something. All right, spot on. I think I'm one short here. Yep, looks like. All right, so I reckon I need to get like five of those ones. Let's just do 20 in here first. All right, so I need to get at least another... 15, I want to say, of those, and 15 reds. We'll do that first so I don't do the wrong ones. 15 of the red ones. Seems like it's about right. A little bit of overkill. So I need the uh, jade, and I need the... Snow. So I probably don't need that much. I'll just get five of each. Jade and snow. That way. We don't overdo it. Alright. Hopefully that's enough. Go into here. Go to you. Let's go mythicize. And... Beautiful. Beautiful. Oof, they're starting to get expensive with these Ascension Stones. Got some HP and we got some defense. Um, how many Mythic Stones do I need? Unlock at 15. Oh, I need to unlock. Uh, I actually need to upgrade this Relic. Nice. Very nice. Do we have any left over? We've got a couple left over. I mean, we'll be able to do that sooner or later. <laughs> but don't worry, I feel like we were spamming these Ming Di things before, so we should be able to get them to 15. Yep. And then if we go to Mythicize. Okay, so we do have enough. Thank goodness. So you only need 25 for the last level. Can we make some headway with some of these Ascensions? Um, am I close to any of the other ones? I should probably, honestly, I should probably do the, I should probably do, is it this guy? Zhang Fei? Is he the other guy? Jesus, I keep circling through. I should probably do you. I, I'll, I'll just, I'll stick to you. <laughs> let's just, let's focus on one thing today, PB. I actually don't think I've got any honor left, so that's not good. Uh, let's check these ones out, see whether or not someone's already hitting it. And of course, it's MPEG back again. And his little buddy that wants to join along. But that's okay. We will be able to get that at some point later today. Do I have any of these Quillian boxes? I don't. Interesting. Interesting. Well, that might be something that we need to invest in in the event as well. Do I have enough Ascension Stones before I even get ahead of myself? Um, Ascension Stones, Ascension Stones. We've got 31. Not quite enough, but that's okay. We can keep chipping away at that. I feel like that's probably not going to be my idea. So what do we end up at at the moment? 78451. Interesting. Very interesting. So before we go any further, 
Let's see if there's some little things that we can do to get us across the line. So we get you at Tiger, we got you at Wind. I feel like we could probably spend a little bit of you from the arms race. Let's just go ahead and grab some from the shop. Uh, where are you? Where are you? Ascension stones, accessory stones, I should say. 99 of you makes sense. Then we can use the furnace. Where is it? Damn it, I forgot where the furnace is. <laughs> right, that's fine. We'll just go through the old fashioned way. Let's go over here. Let's go to the furnace and we're going to smelt. I want to say these ones. Yeah, we're going to smelt those ones because we already maxed those bad boys out a long time ago. Let's get you the three star, which will give us some evasion. Very, very spicy. A little bit of an upgrade. Nothing, nothing huge though. Nothing huge. Let's go ahead and see if we can actually get any, any of these other ones. We probably can't. Can I send you? I can. I don't want to though. I don't want to. Uh, I do want to do you though, because I kind of want to, kind of want to upgrade this guy next, if that makes sense. Like I feel like he's probably going to be the better choice. Engraving stones though. Let's see if we can actually get how many of these can we get? We might actually be able to get a fair, fair whack of them. 120. Is there anyone close to being upgraded for engraving stones? So that's 75 plus 75. Let's go you first then. Let's get you to Phoenix. Get you some extra accuracy and evasion. Not that it really is a huge stat boost, but you know, in the end, it is a stat boost. <laughs> Let's upgrade your level as well, hopefully. Yeah, keep going. Level up. All right, that's good. Training. Ah, the old training. Who's close to getting leveled? Oh, you are. Okay, quick train. Get you to Wen Chan. Oof. I mean, I feel like we could probably, we could probably milk this. We could probably make it happen. All right, who who do we, who do we need to swap out? We need to swap you all out. So let's go ahead and unlock you. Let's go ahead and throw in some of these ones. Defense, that's disgusting, but we're going to replace it anyway. <laughs> what about over here? Pierce uh, could be worse, I guess. <laughs> Could be worse, right? Ooh, oh, wow. Attack 20%. Damn. Managed to roll that on this one. Okay, well, I'll take it. I mean, it is it is what it is. It's not PvP damage, but I guess we'll take that anyway. All right, so that's, uh, that's it. We're very, very close. And I'm trying to wreck my brain to think, what could we possibly do to get us across that line? What is there in our bag that could make that happen? Hmm. I mean, it has been a minute. It has been a little bit of a minute. And I have been thinking about it. We could get Seduce. We could go ahead and get Seduce. Because I feel like that's not going to be a bad alternative for this account. Um, so let's go ahead and grab the Merits. And let's go to the Arms Race. I believe we should have enough to do it. Um, I don't need that many, do I? Do I? I feel like I need that many. <laughs> I feel like I need 100, and I'm probably right about that. So let's go ahead and grab the Seduce out. So, Deployed Glamour. Is it called Glamour? It is. I call it, I call it Seduce because that's what it does. Um, Tactics-wise, let's go ahead and make you... And we do, ooh, we got 10% block. Interesting. All right. Oh, there we go. Let's go. A little bit of a, a little bit of a power up boost. Um, Shang Fei or you? Nah, Papa Chu's getting that. He's going round one. He's a hundred percent getting that. Look at that. 80 billion. Who would have thought we would have managed to cap out at 80 billion? All right. Good investment strategy. <laughs> I never doubted me for a second, right? Uh, 
For those that guessed 80 billion, congratulations in the comment section down below. But let's see if we can manage to get this one leveled up a little bit further. And then we can do some PvP action. Because I need to re reclaim my position as number three. <laughs> I need to reclaim my role. Uh, how many of these things do I have though? I have 96. All right, well, you know what? I think we may be able to get you to maybe rank four. Maybe. Fingers crossed. 50-50. How many do you need? Oh, easy cap. Maybe rank five. What do you reckon? Rank five? It's a lot of them there. It's, it, it looks like it's going to be possible. Or are we going to be like five short? I feel like we're going to be like five short or something. Some crazy amount. Oh, a lot more than five short. You know what? That's fine. We can go ahead and grab some. Oh, actually, no, it went, it went over. It worked. Oh, I did not even realize. Okay, so we did get you to level five, which is not too bad at all. Let's go ahead and research you out because I know we do have a crap ton of these things. Um, so Glamour, we got one of you. Let's go and grab another one. 81 billion. Let's go. Let's go, ladies and gentlemen. 81 billion. I did not expect us to get there. Uh, no cap there. I really didn't think we'd be able to eke out almost 7 billion um, just for what we had, which was not a lot, but, you know, obviously it was enough. 81 billion. We managed to rank number five. So in saying that, let's go celebrate and take, let's take the fight to David. Let's see if we can, we might have to buy one of these attempts. Let's go have some fun. Uh, formation wise, duh, 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 that makes sense. We have Moonlight Dancer. We all know we won because it says so on the screen, but let's see how we won indeed. Slow it down a little bit. Ah, oh, good old Jiang Wei. I mean, Pixiu is a game changer. His uh, reflection is just a pain in the backside. Hopefully you all managed to grab him during this previous billionaire event for those that were lagging a little bit behind. Damn, he nearly chopped my Xiaoji in half. <laughs> nice. If anyone's curious, Tiger Power is certainly worthwhile investing in a control team, uh, particularly if you are running the Wei Nation. It's quite, quite powerful because it keeps stacking up damage against controlled targets, which is phenomenal for those that don't know. Of course, our picture decides to proc, which is fantastic. We do get the shield, and then Zhang Fei comes in, chops down the front row. I mean, I'm liking, I'm liking this team. It might not be the greatest team in the world, but I am certainly enjoying playing with it. Ayo, hey Moonlight Dance did nothing. <laughs> oh my gosh. Uh, I need to upgrade it. I need to get it to level four to get that silence chance up. Alrighty then, poison out. Let's see if we can speed this up again. Now that we saw all of our lovely little beasts proccing, which is fantastic. And I was thinking we could have got the skin for old mates, but you know what? Honestly, I feel like we did. We picked good. We picked good. Getting that uh, legendary. It was well worth it. Immunity. My goodness, this game just loves Pixiu, doesn't it? You freaking love Pixiu, don't you, buddy? <laughs> All right, War God carrying the team. Old Mate Papa Chu doing some solid damage. Zhang Fei surprisingly doing some decent DPS as well. On the enemy team, of course, Zhang Wei carrying them. Um, honestly, though, did our, did our Thunder Beast do much? Our Thunder Pony kind of did the same. Pixiu did decent, Inferno Kitty pretty stock standard, Moonlight Dance, and of course the Tiger Power Charm, not too bad, not too bad. So, is there anything else that we want to play around with? We can...
probably see if there's anything in Warlords Clash. But we are a little bit low. I don't think we're going to be fighting anyone super duper strong. It always worries me when I see Dank Stash. But not when it's a one star Dank Stash. <laughs> when it's a five star Dank Stash with the uh, Mythic Sword, that worries me. All right, maybe we can get a little bit higher. A little bit. Mm. Still keeps giving us the low balls. I mean, that gave me a three-star. Hojo. Oh, my dude. You went with Hojo? Come on. That's not a good choice. Go Date or don't go at all. Yeah. I feel like we're not going to be able to find anyone that's decent, <laughs> which sucks. It sucks because when you want to like actually have some fights and enjoy the whole process, you can't really do that. Let's go into our good old faithful ranking system and fight the dudes above us. Who we got? So we've got Magi, Magi, who's a little bit stronger. Let's see if we can fight this guy. See if uh, see if the old seduce procs of Papa Chu. I'm curious now. Didn't look like it's seduced. Interesting. I want no. It, it has to because my other account only has a one star. Uh, whew, that's annoying. I thought it would have seduced. Maybe it's off the uh, basic attack. Hmm. Oh well, it doesn't matter as long as he does damage. <laughs> as long as he does damage, I'm a okay. Ooh, he has the uh, he has the flame dragon uh, tactic. Very nice. Hey, uh, finally silence. Thunder beast proking. Very nice. Magi soul staying alive by the skin of their teeth. But I think it might be all over soon. There we go. Finally saw us seduce. Looking for that little love heart. How tanky do you want to be, sir? How tanky do you want to be? And for those that don't know, running a double Zhang Fei lineup pretty much means you get continual rage to all of your team. <laughs> That's kind of why you run it, because he does give four random rage, uh, which is pretty fantastic. All right, so he was pretty cool, pretty strong. Let's go and verse old mate Wolfgar. The menace to society with his four-star Papa Chu. Love that. I mean, his wreckage is just so strong. He really does some pretty phenomenal damage. Please don't silence me. <laughs> Please don't. Okay, we taunted them. Very nice. Damn. He just took out my back row, Zhang Fei. What a beast. And he stunned me too. I don't know if we win this. Poison, right, right. If you don't know, the poison stacks based on the war god Liao Zhang's attack too, so it's quite lethal. Hmm. I feel like Papa Chu is just a pain in the backside. And he finally dies. Six star Xiao Ji, very, very nice. I want to get mine up. I need to get mine up on all my accounts, actually. I've been a little bit lazy with my spending of gold. Look at him go. Old mate Papa Chu oh, carrying the team. Just just pretend War God's not there. It's only Papa Chu. <laughs> Damn, even his one did quite nicely as well. Um, Valiant Zhang Fei got wiped out early on, so they kind of sucked. Yawning Way, not too bad for a main protagonist. So, I think we did pretty good. 81 billion. Um, 
it's a, it's a reasonable power up. Hopefully by the end of the event, we'll be able to grab some extra shards to upgrade our weapons. Um, but let me know, is this event treating you well? Like to be completely honest with you, I feel like this is like where we got most of our power from was the beast gears. So for those that are curious, G4 beast gear is definitely worth the investment if you aren't running G4s. Um, even though it couldn't be a little bit of a gamble if you do manage to get like a full set, which we did, obviously. Somehow we have a spare uh, G4 helmet, which kind of sucks. Anyway, thanks for watching. For those that stuck around until the end, and I'll catch you all in the next one.